Hi you guys, welcome back to the channel. So, as you can see from the title and me sitting here looking busted, we are here for another grocery haul. Now, this one is probably my biggest grocery haul up to date. The budget has never changed, if you're new to this channel. I usually have a $325 budget every two weeks. And this is one of the shopping hauls, but I feel like on this one, we're gonna last a little bit longer. To jump right into it, two of the places that I actually shopped at this time was Winn-Dixie and Target. Target seems like the place you see David back there. Say hey, babe. Hey. And my friend Keanu, if you see another hand over there. This time I got really, really, really good deals because I was smart about it. The deal for Winn-Dixie pickup is if you spend $75, um, you will get $10 off. Also, Target is having promotions. I don't know if everyone gets this, but for me, um, if you spend more than $80, you get $25 in rewards. And plus I had a 25% off of my total Plus, there were certain deals and things on sale, and there were some good rebates, especially when it comes to, as you will see, the alcohol. If you want to get alcohol and get it conveniently, I promise you Target is one of the best places to get it from because I, the last two or three times, you can go ahead, the last two or three times that I have gotten alcohol from Target, there have been rebates, and I guess how you get the rebates is they email it to you and you can cash out through Venmo or PayPal. And that's how you get your money, but it has to be at least a $5 minimum. So without further ado, I don't think there's nothing else. Like I said, spent $325 on everything you will see here today. I'm pretty excited. I'm pretty proud of myself this time because I really took advantage. As you know, if you do not have a Winn-Dixie, Winn-Dixie had buy one, get one, and most of this is buy one, get one, or Target sales, and then I also use the $25 reward as well. Although with the $25 reward, you do have to have three payments of $80 or more in order to get the $25 rewards, but what I did, I broke up each payment so that, um, I was able to get the reward and use it on other products. And that's how David got his beer, who you'll see today. So we can go ahead and walk through everything I have gotten today. If you have any questions, please comment down below because I feel like your girl's getting pretty good off of this. Now, you won't see me do the shopping thing as much as from my first very, my very first shopping video because your girl be doing curbside everything. If you don't know by now, it's curbside all day, every day. I don't got time, nor do I feel like grocery shopping. I'd rather do it online and pick it up. And that's what I did today. So let's go ahead without further ado. Let's get into everything I got for this shopping trip. Starting from left to right, I ended up getting some turkey. This time I did not have a lot in mind when it came to what meals I was gonna cook. I was just looking at the deals and some things I knew I wanted to cook. Typically I do get this from Sam's Club, but like I said, I wanted to shop at one place. I also got something really different this time and this is some um, ribs. And they're already pre-sliced up and all you gotta do is cook it there. I believe this, as you see, this is $7.89. This was like $12.99. I also got some ground beef you know i don't really like ground beef but i noticed the last time i made some tacos i ended up mixing these two together and that was pretty good so i decided to do that again i got this bag i think it's like uh yeah one pound bag of salmon this was actually like 6.99 or something on salmon with dizzy at least on their website it was so i got that and some pork tenderloin and this was $7.39. This is the um, lemon herb seasoning one. So we'll see how this goes. But I like to cut these up and cook it with mashed potatoes. Speaking of mashed potatoes, I forgot my dip, but that's okay. We'll get that when it's time. Um, recently, I, you know, I always get these, but I recently got these because um, I had came on the plug and made, what was that? Was that the spaghetti I put the twist on? What was that I cooked recently? It was a spaghetti, right? Or no? I don't, I don't even remember either. So the likelihood of that turning up is, you know, whatever. But I do remiss, remember mixing this chopped up with some uh, Alfredo sauce and tomato sauce. 
And this is for breakfast. I got some sausage links, but try not to go too much that way. Uh, I got some ice cream. These were buy one, get one free. I honestly thought these was the other ones, but it's not. So let me get these ice creams out of the way because they're melting. So I got vanilla, this, and cheesecake. I also got this one, so I want to go ahead and get these out of the way. But these are also a 12-pack of chocolate and vanilla, vanilla, <laughs> vanilla and chocolate. And I'm just switching up something easy to give and portion control when it comes to growing ice cream. Oh, I do have more ice cream. <laughs> Sorry. Trying to get the ice cream out the way. So, wait, I didn't... So these two are drumsticks as well. These will buy one, get one free. And when Dixie, I don't remember how much these cost, but switching it up. We're having fun with life. Going down here, your girl has been on a very much a flavor water situation. So I had got some more of these. I typically keep these in the drawer and try to mix them around. But you know how TikTok is. TikTok gets you into the flavor water thing. But it's way better than drinking juice and stuff, obviously. And they're only um 10 calories. Yeah. 10 calories, so... Next, I have the buy one, get one free of these Crunch Valleys. Um, these are just like healthy snacks. Now, all the snacks you're going to see here today is because of me and David do a lot of gig work. So when we're on um, our little trips in the car, this helps a lot. Also, these are healthier snacks for the girls when we do want to give them snacks. I typically don't get as many snacks as you will see here today, but... They were on sale, they were a good deal, and lately it's been convenient uh, with how busy we are to have a good healthy snack on deck. So, got these. Don't remember how much these cost, but I believe it was like about $5. Still on the snack trend, I got this variety pack of toasted cheese, to uh, peanut butter, and I guess this is like a chive and cream cheese. I know David and... Um, Nala loves them, kind of the peanut butter stuff. I'm assuming because you, you always get the peanut butter. So, um, they like the peanut butter. I got the variety because I want them to have the variety. As you will see, and I'll kind of scan over as far as the cereal, you will kind of see it throughout. But there was a lot of buy one, get one freeze of the cereal. Y'all know on average, all the cereal is under six bucks. So, I got Captain Crunch. Raisin Bran because sometimes I like to be old and then uh, Lucky Charms. So I have two of each one of those which you will see up top. Got some barbecue chips. It's just chips. Nothing to really say about that. But also got a little 12 mega roll of some Charmin Ultra because it's just that time. So I had to get that. But this was on sale for like $19. So got went ahead and got that but this is also another good deal because this is a 42 pack of chips and this was on sale for 19 dollars at at target so i went ahead and snacked up some of those because like you said when we doing gig work this really helps out a lot between having the girls have snacks and us being able to have snacks while we're on the road as well i ended up getting some Simply Lemonade. This is strawberry. I believe that is fruit punch, lemonade, and orange juice because I had got some stuff from mimosas, which I kind of scanned over. But this was actually on sale, $6.99 for the Andres. So I got two of those so we can make some good mimosas. And also I have some whiskey that I like to mix these juices with. So that's why I got those. Sorry you guys if I'm kind of rambling a lot. I'm kind of short on battery. And I'm trying to get these groceries up. So if you have any questions, concerns, or critiques on how I am doing these grocery haul, please don't hesitate to comment down below because I do really like the doing these and any critique to make this a better experience for y'all is something I want to do. So yeah, but continuing on, um, I recently, I recently been on the trend of not trend, but the kick of wanting to try frozen and making the whole chopping experience very <laughs> chill. That's for me. <laughs> Kiana made me a uh, drink, so let's go ahead. 
she's our little mixologist so she had made me a cup and you know we like to drink over here so let's give this a try Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's good. That's really good. Thank you. So, going to this, I want to incorporate the onions, and I want to get lazy on that. So, I decided to try to do the frozen onions, peppers, and things like that. As well as, I, I just seen these from Target, but it says sautéed chopped onions so i guess it's already pre-cooked i don't really know but they have them in blocks isn't this cool this honestly look like fish bait <laughs> but i got three cartons of these you can never go wrong with onions so i'm hoping that these is a is a hit the only downside is if you want the taste or the crunch of onions you're not going to get this with that so we'll see how this goes though i only care about the taste most of the time we got some mac and cheese for the girls try to get them to eat more solid food we also have some gogurt this was also buy one get one i have one right there so again i'm snapped up this time so just someone else not me got the coca-cola pack and somebody tell me why coca-cola is so expensive i don't understand why i think canned soda in general but especially coca-cola something about it that i always find extremely expensive but these things, I think the cheapest I've seen, like a 12 pack is like 10 bucks. Bay got that for his Hennessy and Coke. So, <laughs> yeah. Um, got some muffins. Again, more work stuff. Also got this 12, this 24 pack of Bud Light. Now, with the Bud Light, it was a really good deal from Target. It was about $21.99 for that. But they had $8 in rebate. And like I told you earlier, they just email it to you. You add it to your PayPal and you get that money back as long as you got $5 minimum in your rebate. So really got that for less. Got some garlic bread. This was buy one, get one free because for when we make pastas and things like that, um, we'll see how we like it pre already made like that. But yeah, got some marshmallow with cream. I absolutely love this. I, I, Use this for my frappuccinos that I make. I like to make this real Captain Crunch frappe drink. And it's really good. Let me know if you want to see that recipe. Going down here, I have a pack of shrimp. I just got it because it was cheap, honestly. I think it was like $5.99. So I ended up grabbing that. And this was a bag of cheese. A big bag of cheese on sale for $7.99. This is another thing that I don't understand why it'd be so expensive, but it do be. But this is probably the biggest bag I ever bought. I like to use cheese and like my grits and um, I don't know what else. Maybe just my grits. Yeah, maybe so. I got two things of cheese sticks for the girls. Got some chicken bouillon. This is like the tiniest thing ever, so I don't even know why I got that. I usually get the big one from Sam's Club. That's like five bucks, but this is the only ones I can find anywhere else. As far as seasonings, I got this chili lime because why not? Some minced onion. I saw this lime sauce. I felt like I can put this on tacos or something. And I bought this spray thing of, I can't believe it's not butter because I usually get the big tin of this. But I feel like I'm not buying real butter anyway. So why not give this a try? So I bought this. I got two things of strawberries. This was two for six bucks at Winn Dixie. Getting that fruit sand. I got some hot dogs for the girls. I don't remember how much this costs, but. Got some hot dogs as kind of like a snack for them. If you have any ideas for good snacks for your kids, healthy or unhealthy, please let me know. But something that's going to be hearty to help them eat better. I got some checkers fries because we got an air fryer and this cooks them well. Got some popcorn seasoning with our two popcorns that i got over here 
found this and I just feel like I could pass it up because it's buy one get one free and it's cinnamon toast crunch and I felt like I could bake something that makes this bussin. Maybe even with these biscuits that you see back here. This was also buy one get one free. There's some flaky honey butter biscuits. So maybe I can chop it on there. I don't know, but maybe we'll see. Then I got 10% of battery. <laughs> I gotta walk through this. I still can't believe how much groceries I got. This is like crazy. So I end up getting some cat food for our cat Sage. If you don't know, I do have a cat. So got some cat food for him. Some little waters. I paid way too much for this. It was like six bucks for this little 12 pack. That's actually ridiculous. So I don't know why I did it, but I did. Got some Seagram's because this had a $5 rebate and you know this is usually like 14 15 bucks five dollar rebate this made this super cheap for this 12 pack so i had to get that got a couple little handfuls as you will see going down here i'm gonna try to piece these together but i have many boxes of tv dinners so i got about eight boxes of this uh beef and broccoli bowls these are so good these are my favorite microwave bowl dinners and since i have discovered them i stack up on it for sure these are so good and amazing if you have not tried it definitely give it a try um i have these hot pockets got this for david never tried it before but it looked good but for some reason when it comes to hot pockets they don't like to sell the meatballs one anymore um at least here in our neck of the woods. I've been in many places looking for meatball hot pockets and it seems hard to find. They only sell them in two packs and that's it. And even that is kind of scarce. Got some vanilla wafers because they would like nighttime ice cream with vanilla wafers. And I got also down here a little two pack of coffee creamer because your girl loves coffee. Got these eight packs, four eight packs of these little juicy juices because I didn't want to get a Capri Sun. And they were $2.50 a pack. Right here, I just got a couple cans of vegetables because I already had some or whatever, but just adding a little bit more. This is kind of self-explanatory, but that's all I got in vegetables. Got this TV dinner as well. Never had it before. Got two of them. It's just one behind here. And this was, I think, two fifty two. I got these two things for my tacos. Recently had this when I had a taco night with my niece and I feel like I can't go back now. These things are good. They are similar, not quite exact as the, the Domino's one from Taco Bell, but they're definitely close enough. Put some sour cream on there and you, you, you good to go. Ooh, I'm running out of breath. I'm tired of hearing myself talk too, but we almost threw the whole thing. I got some milk. I only, I'm lactose intolerant. So I have to do Fair Life. That seems like the only one that works for me right now. I used to drink uh, Lactate, but Lactate doesn't work for me anymore. So Fair Life is the only one that seems to work for me right now. So I have to buy this expensive milk just because of that. Milk for the girls. Got some tomato sauce because it was on sale. Never seen this one by Ragu, but it was on sale. So hopefully it's not bad. Got some more cereal. Forgot to mention this earlier. Golden Puffs, one of my favorite. Judge yourself, not me. But definitely one of the ones that is my favorite. This is probably the only like bootleg brand of cereal that I really love. Got some oranges. I think I mentioned the eggs earlier. I don't know. I mixed this in with the white egg yolk cartons that I get from Sam's Club. I still have some left. So Grapes is another thing that's really expensive for no reason at all. It's probably a reason, but I can't justify it. But the girls like it, so I still get it. Got some green onions. Some lettuce for the tacos and sometimes my own salad. Got onion seasoning. And going to the last bit of stuff. Ooh, girl, child. Took a long time to get here. But there's just a couple of little supplies that I got for the girls. I ended up recently going school shopping for them. This is just a couple more things that they kind of needed to add to their list. But it's just pencil sharpener and their little pencil cases. And I needed some edge control for my pro style. Whew. 
I feel like that was a workout in itself. Sorry I had to talk so fast, but y'all see, that was a lot of stuff that I actually got and I had to get through this. <laughs> so not. But hopefully it wasn't too talky and too rambling, but I think I did extremely good on this little session or whatnot. So this house, we should be good. Let's see how far we stretch it because I do got a couple more meats that I got from my last round. So yeah, I hope you like this video. That is gonna be all for this video or whatnot. If you have any questions, please be sure to comment down below. And if you made it this far to this video, please comment down below an uh, apple down in the comments. I definitely love you guys and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.